أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي أمري وحلل عقدة من لساني يفقه قولي رب زدني علما Assalamu alaikum. How is everyone doing? Alhamdulillah. How is everyone doing? Alhamdulillah. Okay. Can I please request you to, to turn off your cameras? And also when I ask you a question, answer only once. Alhamdulillah, I'm fine. Okay, now let's have a look at now let's have a look at your names. Those have you those have you those of you who have done the assignments. Nafia Mariam Ainal Hujera Alicia Aisha Zainab Yusuf Yahya Mariam. Well done guys. Ayman Abdul Karim, Farwa, Maryam, Mahira, Aisha, Zunaira, Hashim Ali Khalid, Mayra, Rafia, Arshad, Khadija Farooq, Tumay Nina, Zara, Samiha, Nasira, Arham, Shayan, Rayan and Ayanaya. Awesome. Rafia Arshad, Abdul Some trouble with Zoom, please excuse me. Can you all please turn off your cameras? Rafia Arshad, Abdul Qadi and Abdul Ahad. Mehek, Abdul Hadi, Abdullah Abdurrahman, Muhammad Ahmed. Ataka, Zainab, Abdul Malik, Abdullah Tanbir. Amazing. Saif and Hiba, Saim, Farik, Reham, Ikra and Musab, Zina, Afran and Ahad. So proud of you. Imad, 
फवाजुद्दीन तारिफा यूसुफ शरीफ जईमा हमजा लुकमान मुस्फरा मुंतसर सफिया हनीफा एंड फातिमा ईशाल नमार मोहम्मद उजैर अजान इब्राहिम comes up Yesterday we learned about early life of Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam early life of Imran Khan early life of Bella Please only answer once Umar Zainab Aisha Khan Ayman just answer once very good Yusuf Ayman Sheikh Umar and Hana Afariq Saif Noura Ayan well done correct answers from you just answer only one and please can we request you to turn off your cameras What's the name of the mother of Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam Princess Zainab Queen Sarah Amina Excellent job Amina Well done Imad Ziba Aska Fauza Muhammad Fatim Arij Umar Noura Arwa Excellent job Abdullah was Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam's best friend dad or teacher Dad, excellent job. Manha Ayan, A A S F, Ziba Fatima, Muhammad Faris, Huzefa, Aska Huda and Hana, Ishal. Excellent job, everyone. After the death of his grandfather Abdul Muttalib. Who took care of Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam? His uncle Abu Talib, his best his best friend John, his aunt Mary. Excellent job, his uncle Abu Talib. Do you love your grandfather? Option one, yes, but only when he gives me chocolate. Option two, yes, always. Some say one. Some, some, say some, two. some are also saying one. Very good. Those are the truthful ones. Okay. Namir, Saif, and Hiba, Ayan, Ishal, Huzefa, Amar, Hamdan, Hana, Ayan. All of you, great answer. My answer, yes, always. Which country is this? Did you guys see the map yesterday? Syria. Good and job everyone. Syria. Today we are going to explore more about Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam's uncle Abu Talib Although Abu Talib and his wife were not rich people they often absolutely loved Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam and tried their best to take care of him Journey to Syria with uncle Abu Talib On the border of Syria and Jordan there is a city called Basra When they reached Basra, they met a monk. His name was Bahira. Bahira told Abu Talib that he is a messenger of Allah. Abu Talib was surprised and asked him, "How do you know?" Bahira said, "I saw that 
that I saw trees and stones prostrating to me, to him. They only prostrate before a prophet. Seal of prophethood. Bahira also saw a seal of prophethood between his shoulders. In their books, it was mentioned that below the shoulders there is a piece of raised flesh. That's the seal of prophethood. Abu Talib took him back. Bahira said that suggested that Abu Talib take take Prophet وسلم, back to Mecca and, and not to go to Syria because Prophet وسلم, might be in danger because of the Jews there. So Abu Talib took him back to Mecca. Prophet وسلم's childhood. He used to graze goats. He also learned archery. Have you ever, have you tried archery? Yes, I absolutely love it. No, but I want to try. Okay, now you can type. Some say, Okay, Some Josefa say, has tried it. Abdul Hadi has tried it. Amna Ahmed is saying that she wants to try. Josefa has tried it. Aska Huda has have tried it with their toys. Amna Ahmed wants to try it. Josefa has tried it. Ayman has uh, wants to try. Uh, okay, Ayan has tried. Um, Zufra wants to try. Okay, Abdul Ahad Khan wants to try. All right. Okay, excellent job, everyone. Yes, I absolutely love it, but I want to try again. Okay. Do you know that Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam encouraged us to know, us to learn archery, horse riding, swimming? Can you swim? Yes. I love it. No, but I learned soon, inshallah. Yeah, no. Shayan can swim. Abdul Qadir can swim. Samiha wants to try. Shayan can swim. Zufra can swim. Ziba wants to try. Fezan can swim. Okay, Fezan wants to try. Uh, Azmir, no, I can't swim. Uzair wants to try. Abdul Ahad can swim. Ayan can swim. Namir can swim. Uh, Maryam can swim, Saif Hiba can swim, Maryam Abdul Qadir can swim, Aisha Khan will try, Manha can swim, Maryam, okay. I know, I've seen people do it, but I won't, I, I haven't learned. Okay, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam's trade journey. People of Quraysh, the tribe of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, were traders. They used to move to Yemen during, during during winter and Syria in summer. This is found in Quran in Surah Quraysh. Would anyone like to recite it for us? I'll give access to my cup. Okay, Nasheen, I'm going to unmute you. Okay, Ila fi Kuresh, Ila fi him Rihlata Shita, he was safe. Falia Abudu Rabbaha the bed, a lazy at Amahum Minju, but Amanahum Minkoff. Excellent job, Nashin. Well done. Okay, Safia Sayyid, I'm going to unmute you. Go ahead. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. 
Excellent job. Well done, Sophia. Okay, Siman, I'm going to unmute you. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Li ila fi Quraysh, ila fi him rehla tashita iwa saif. Fal yabudu Rabbi haza al-bayt, al-lazi atu'amahum min ju'in wa amanahum min khawf. Excellent job, Siman. Well done. Ishaal and Amar, I'm going to unmute you. Yes. Excellent. That was very good. MashaAllah. Okay. Mariam Ahmad Abdul Qadir, I'm going to unmute you. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم لإلى في قريش إلى فيهم رحمة رحلة الشتاء والصيف فليعبدوا رب هذا البيت الذي أتمهم من جوع وأمنهم من خوف. Excellent job, well done. Zofra, I'm going to unmute you. Excellent job, Zubair. Well done. I'm Zufra. Okay, okay. Excellent job, Zufra. Well done. Okay. Shiza, I'm going to unmute you. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim Li'ila fi Quraysh Ila fihim rihla Shita wa swayf Fal'abudu Rabba hal al-bayt Ladhi yata'amahum min ju'in Wa'amanahum min khawf Excellent job, well done! Okay, Muhammad Farak, I'm going to unmute you. A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Ila fi Quraysh, ila fi him rihlita shutai wassad. فَلْيَعْبُدُ رَبَّ هَذَا الْبَيْتِ الَّذِي أَتَعَمَهُمْ مِنْ جُو وَآمَنَهُمْ مِنْ خَوْفِ Excellent job. Well done. We'll move on. Rest of the case. Don't be sad. Inshallah, you'll get another chance. Sadiq and Al-Amin. Since Prophet ﷺ never lied, he became famous in Mecca with the name As-Sadiq, the one who always speaks the truth. Since he always took care of things that belong to other people, he became famous with the name Al-Amin, the one who can be trusted. 
Meaning, if you leave a thing to, with him, he won't do anything bad to those things. Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was known in Mecca as a Sadiq Al-Amin, Harry Potter, Prince of Mecca. Okay, yes, a Sadiq and Al Amin. Khadija bin. Difference between Radiallahu Anha and Radiallahu An. Radiallahu Anhu is used for a man, Radiallahu Anha is used for a woman. Trade time. Khadija radiallahu anha heard that Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is truthful and trustworthy. So she sent an offer to Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam to do some business for her, which meant that Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam had to go to Syria with her trading things. Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam accepted the offer and went to Syria with Khadija's slave. Masala. He did the business super, superbly and brought a lot of money with him. No other man had brought so much money for Khadija ever before. The slave... Mm, The slave Masara also praised Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam a lot in front of Khadija. He said that Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam was very nice, soft, good, mannered, and honest man. Khadija was very impressed. Marriage with Khadija, the Prophet's beloved. Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa and Khadija radiallahu anha then got married. Khadija radiallahu anha was a very, very loving and caring wife. Yeah. That's all for today. Would, would, would. Would you like to say anything? Please raise hand. Okay, Sidra, I'm going to unmute you. Okay, Afshin, I'm going to unmute you. Yes, hello. Uh, yes, can, can, can you, you hear me? me? Yes, I can hear you. I like the today's story, uh, like uh, how that man said to uh, his uncle Abu Talib that he was a prophet. I like that part a lot. Excellent job. Anyone else? When we turn on the mic, please stay prepared with what you have to say, right? Okay, Sarah, I'm going to unmute you. Go ahead. Sarah, would you like to say something? Oh, uh, yes. I want to say that. Oh, what is today's assignment? Okay, that's uh, okay. 
I'll show you in a while. Okay, Fat Fatin. Fatin, I'm yeah. going to unmute you, inshallah. Fatin, I'm going to unmute you. Okay, Fatin, go ahead. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. The story. Okay, excellent job. Okay. Yeah. Khadija. Khadija, I'm going to unmute you. I love the story. I love to hear about the story. I love the story. I love the Sira stories very much. And it was very awesome. Thank you. Excellent job. Alicia, I'm going to unmute you. I like you when you read stories. Excellent job. Okay, Ali Rahman, I'm going to unmute you. <coughs> Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu maham. Wa alaikum asalam, Aliza. Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is a trustworthy and well-mannered man. I like it when you tell stories. Uh, about the Prophet Muhammad, you tell them very nicely, and I understand everything quickly. Good job, Aliza. Well done. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Josefa, Hamdan, and Ayan, do you want to say something? Please tell me if I'm not. No? Okay. Omar and Hannah, I'm going to unmute you. Go ahead. Uh, is the class finished? Almost. Okay. Okay. So the assignment, okay, the assignment is Please tell the story to three people, and when you're done, send us your names in the WhatsApp group, and we will share your names tomorrow in the class. Okay, so this is the end of the class, inshallah. See you tomorrow, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. And please don't be sad if we have not taken you today, inshallah. We'll be taking uh, you tomorrow or the after tomorrow. Bye. Thank you.